sure that we're gonna hear we're gonna see the the uh pac-man yeah for sure and uh something interesting about this is you can uh you just saw on stream logan uh i think he was been playing banjo the whole tournament but he actually uh used to main pac-man I, I know he still plays him <clears throat> so j-rex is gonna have a lot of experience in this matchup um but the thing is like cortex and logan play have very different play styles so um as most people will tell you logan has a very read heavy play style he he just wants to know exactly what you're doing and he wants to punish you for it which is interesting that he plays these setup characters um, and it, but it works really well for him. Whereas Cortex, um, well, I'm not saying that like he doesn't, you know, he doesn't do, he doesn't have reads, but he is mostly a setup based player. So he, you know, he knows what he wants to do before this game starts, and then he's going to execute his game plan to the best of his ability, which kind of is what we're seeing here. Even though, um, so I like the the Falco pick a lot from J Rex, just because of obviously like you know, haha, he has a reflector, easy matchup, but. Uh, Falco has a lot of like a lot of good spacing tools to kind of like Falco's a kind of a character where you know he it looks like he wants to keep you out but he can also kind of box with you in the mid range. Um, he has really like pretty good frame data and that reflector um, I don't want to misspeak but in Smash 4 it was frame 1 the reflector came out on frame 1. Uh, which makes it really good at reflecting things, like more so than most reflectors. And he gets the jump for you, but doesn't quite kill. I know as a youngling uh, player, I hate Falco's reflector. It's really annoying. Yeah, it's <laughs> really good. Um, oh, so the up tilt. Yeah, he's two high percent. So that up tilt is a, is a Falco's bread and butter for kill confirms at like lower percents. Um, if they're not ready to di properly, you can wow. get. Wow. Yeah, he actually could have teched that. Um, if they're not ready to DI properly, you can get up tilt into back air for a disgustingly early KO. And then lo later percents, if you follow their DI, you can get the up air. Really surprised uh, Cortex didn't go for that uh, punish there, just kind of stood there. Yeah, I'm not sure. I think he's not really familiar with the matchup, so he didn't really know how, uh, how much lag that had. It looks like... Cortex, uh... Oh, ra ra Wes, it looks like off-stream, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt, but it looks like Wes beat Rex, so... Just an update there. A good win for Wes, that's, uh, second, second time. Second time. So, oh, win for the F-Smash read. Wow, really good up tilt anti-air from Cortex. That move is really difficult to use. Cortex just kind of running away with this now. Oh, yeah, wait, 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 wait for them to play the stream. Uh, we're gonna play all the rest of the matches on stream, so. What is up, gamers? Hey. So. Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah okay, you're, okay. You're, you're live. Um, <clears throat> What's up, man? Not much, man. Just uh, watching this match. Uh, Cortex just. Like he's got a good lead right yeah, now. Yeah, he's, he's got a really good lead. Um, it was very even to start, and Cortex just started getting everything going. He got several, like, good reads. Oh, no. Oh, that was a little scary. Who is this J-Rex? So J-Rex, uh, he's act he like he plays with Logan a lot, and so he used to come around a lot. Um, so he should know the Pac-Man matchup. So, um, <gasps> but he's made a he's made a, like a pretty good run. So, not like oh, no, oh, he died tech. to that one. It, I think he was dying up. It looked like it was untackable. Yeah. Um, the red sparks did appear. Yeah, I think it, the only way that would have worked is if he held up. So, which makes sense because he was probably trying to up B. Yeah. Um. But like I was saying, he he actually made a he made a really good run, um, like taking nothing against his run, but he he fought a couple of people that made some upsets, so he was able to to get like a pretty good spot in this bracket and well yeah looking to looking to keep going here. I think he's I think the loser loser of this gets seventh, don't they? Mm -hmm. So this is top eight, so the loser will get seventh, which is it's really good. Yeah, great stuff to both players making it this far. I don't think either. No, no. Cortex was seed like fifth or something. Yeah, uh, J Rex was just outside the top eight seed. Um, just because I, um, he he's been playing with Logan. He's he's improved like a lot since since I've seen him around. Cortex or uh, J Rex? J Rex. Cortex is always constantly improving, constantly getting good results. Oh, oh he actually had the read there, no. but he didn't pull the trigger. I'm a little scared. I have to fight the winner of this. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. Alright, good grab. 
Oh, gets the gets the upper follow up, but nothing more. Keeping him in disadvantage at least, though. That's always good. Of course. Now, one thing that Falco Ooh. does have in this matchup is <gasps> wow. It, he, I was like, expecting was him nuts. to hit the too. trampoline. It, I think he hit him like below it. Oh, and he's taking this and he's running with it as hard as he can this right now. This Smashville counter pick so good for him right now. Nice a high recovery. <gasps> oh, he tried to check yeah, that. That's okay. easy to forget about because the the sheer distance it yeah, goes. It, it's surprising because like it's <gasps> Oh okay, yo, that was J Rex clean. is popping off. <laughs> that was kinda clean. That was kinda clean, I'm not gonna lie. He, he reflects it and then combos with yeah. it. Oh, yeah. He definitely I, knows this matchup. I imagine Cortex does not like this matchup purely because of the reflector. Ooh. Oh, he's oh, he was actually he was actually in Oh, no, he got it anyway. Okay. He was actually an up tilt back air percent there. I was surprised he didn't go for it. Down tilt? Yep. And grab him. Oh, perfect. Oh, my. That was perfect. That covered every option. Yeah. Oh, up F tilt, not too much. Oh, <gasps> managed to pick it up. Z drop? Z drop? Yeah, yeah, I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> I mean, so the thing about Z-dropping it is it, it bounces, and like while it's bouncing, he can't use it. Can you yeah, exactly. Here? You want to keep that out of Pac-Man for as long as possible. Okay. You're still able to hear me, right? Yeah. Okay, because I stopped hearing myself. Yeah, I stopped hearing you for a second, too. Okay. Oh! Oh! Fire. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, I can barely hear myself. Okay. Nice oh, back air. Wow. Oh, wow. I was expecting a bad DBZ DI. moment. <laughs> it, it was definitely bad DI from J Rex, but honestly, I would have expected to get hit the other way as well. Yeah. That's also a super scary situation for Pac I mean, uh, for Falco because it's like super non committal for Pac Man just to run up and throw up Hydrant or like do a down air. Yeah. Yeah, looking like J Rex is, even though he's been doing really good this game, it's looking like he's a little antsy for the kill because Pac Man's at 197. Yeah, I think um, a bad DI on a Falco throw would Just kill. Th what is, would it be back throw that would kill? Uh, up throw or back throw. Okay. So if you DI badly and get hit by the laser, it can kill, like, not early, but, like, it'll kill you. If, like, oh, you, should, really? you should basically never die to it because I think up throw, are, there are some percents where it automatically connects, but, like, back throw, you should never die. Because if you DI correctly, you don't get hit by the laser. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Yo, he is... <laughs> that boy is mashing the down oh, beat. Oh, Back throw? Oh, yeah, see. If you DI it right, you just never get hit. I think up throw was a better better uh, option 238, there. man. You know J-Rex is feeling a little frustrated. There it is, there it is. All yeah. right. At that point, up tilt was going to kill, but... <laughs> 240. Goodness gracious. Saving his jump. Yep. Nice. Oh, what that else? up tilt really. Ooh, I'm, I'm surprised. surprised. He, yeah. That he didn't hit it. Nice. Oh, here we go. It looked like it just didn't connect. Maybe he needed the fast fall on the down air. Ooh, that was, that was a good wall yeah, jump. Yeah, that was a really good wall jump. It was like really well timed, too. Oh, he did it again. <laughs> the Z oh, drop. No. But Cortex was ready for it that. Yeah, time. he was definitely ready for it. Oh, that was so smart. It's not He's death. alive, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Down smash kind of weak. And on top of that, he slid to the left. Yeah, a little bit on the. Uh, probably due to the water a little bit as well. Oh. <gasps> no way. Oh. oh. I mean, wow. Even reflected. Okay. Cortex is taking the approach of never uh, yeah. hit, taking, hitting the high drink because he knows, yeah, uh, he knows he's always going to reflect it. Of course. Wait. No, no, no. I think they're just discussing bands. Oh, okay. Yeah. They both got at sim up simultaneously, so I was like, wait a minute. Hold up. <laughs> Let's say I, I told him it was best of five, so. That yeah, was a good. That was techable that I think, time. I think that's how the first game ended, too, except for it was, it was a down techable. air. Yeah, it was a down air. That towards the stage. All right, so Cortex up 2-0, looking very clean. J-Rex has been ha yeah. having some He's high some highs and yeah. low lows. Also, <laughs> that man was staring hard at us. <laughs> uh, oh, Really? Oh, he got... I th <gasps> you got to think that he probably okay. buffered roll <gasps> in there. Oh, that's never going to kill you. <laughs> Not a zero. Yeah. Does, it, does the spike get like more uh, stronger? It gets knocked back growth. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's not I wasn't a, sure. It's not a lot. It's more than in the other games, uh, other than I think melee. But, um, but you can meet your cancel in melee. But oh, that oh yeah, you couldn't he, quite he get the back air. It. Yeah, the water messed up that combo right there. Unfortunately for J Rex, get out of shield and air. 
He's going for that wall jump side B a lot. It's it's working out for him. I mean, right now, but I'm afraid yeah, Cortex is going to catch get on. An F smash or something. Just going straight to the ledge with the trampoline, not playing around. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh oh. It's always scary because uh, it's so easy to get stuck under the stage with Falco because whenever you uppy, you maintain your momentum. Uh, and so if you're going forward as you're as you upbeat, you'll go under the stage. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. Yeah. And so Cortex is <gasps> Oh, okay. He was ready for yeah. that. Yeah. You got you got to think like Cortex kind of kind of letting it rip a little early there. One thing Cortex isn't adapting to in this game, even though he is up two games, is he's yeah. he's supposed to not use his down B or neutral B as much against Reflector characters, but yeah. he's not really doing that. And pretty much every run of J-Rex's stocks has been taken because of him reflecting almost. Basically. But as, we, as, we, did, as we did see there, we were talking about the end of last game, about how Cortex... Uh, uh, was like being patient on the hydrant. Now he's gotten to the point where he's punishing uh, J Rex for hitting the hydrant. Yeah, that's and that's just adaptation right there. So we got to see the adaptation from J Rex as well. Gonna go for the air dodge read. Oh, he tried oh. to go for the reflect. Yeah, he. I think uh, so. I think Cortex went for the down B, but the other one had uh, the other hydrant hadn't despawned yet. Yeah, it was still getting hit off the left side. Oh, nice. So yeah, he's gonna. The game's <gasps> gonna be one at the ledge here. He's gotta punish Ooh. that man. It's a little scary to punish because of how many angles he can take. Yeah. Oh wow. Okay. That that just. I mean, he wasn't 180, but good or, stuff to J Rex having a consistent lead for the first time this set. Yeah, like I said earlier, the Smashville pick is going really well for him. <gasps> oh wow. Oh, he's really fortunate about that. Yeah. It's Honestly, not edge guarding. <laughs> it's it's, it's very hard to, hard it's to hard edge guard, edge guard Pac-Man, uh, Pac -Man, I know, but at the same time, you're just letting him get back to stage for free every single I'm time. Pretty, I'm pretty sure that there's iframes on his uppy still. I know there used really? to be. I thought there was only iframes on the side B right there. Uh, I, I don't know. They may have changed it. Yeah, they might have. I'm not too sure about it. Ooh. <gasps> oh. Yeah, he did the same thing again. That would have probably been untackable. And even if it wasn't, J-Rex didn't take- He didn't take oh, last time. He Whoa, that, right was, into that. that was cheeky, though. He, like, went in an up angle, and then and then the like, platform, he rode it. Yeah. Yeah. That was pretty uh, unconventional by Cortex, and it got him the stock, so good stuff to him. Oh, man. He, he went for the catch. Oh, that's that's such a tricky thing that Pac-Man will do. Um, <gasps> oh, he's, he's living. Oh, he did. Yeah, I forgot. Smash good angle. Good angle. That was a really good angle, honestly. All right, oh, he, he really Cortex only needs, was ready for it. He needs... Oh, back here? Yeah. <gasps> and that's the game. That was clean. That Great was clean. Great stuff to J-Rex, taking the yeah. first game for himself. Oh, my goodness. That was a good game. Yeah, that was a really good game. Really solid play from both of these guys. Yeah. Bam. Yeah, that was just like... He definitely didn't expect to Cortex to fly at that angle, and honestly, I didn't either. Good stuff to J-Rex, making the adaptations needed to take this to game four. Oh, yeah. Oh. Okay, well, let's see if J-Rex can get another one. It looked like Town and City was the pick here. Cortex thinking he might go to the banjo? Oh, Snake. Okay, okay. I'm surprised. I'm not... He's been playing Snake since the beginning of well, the game. I'm not surprised that his Snake's... I'm not saying that because his Snake's yeah. not good. I'm saying his Pac-Man was working. So... Hmm, I wonder. I wonder what it is. Cortex does stage. this a lot. He does this a lot. Yeah, he, I think he might like the stage better here. Fortunately, oh. I think he can get a nair off that. But oh, uh -oh. these grenades. Oh, this is yeah. not looking like a good no. pick to start off at least. J Rex doing the smart thing and just continually trading with the grenades because now he's got a lead. <laughs> he's got uh, a high lead, fifty percent. Surprised he didn't reflect that. Honestly, there it is, up air. Oh, he actually. Looks like he oh back here almost yeah, killed. It's not quite not quite enough. Snake is very heavy. I think he's I think he's 108. Wait. Which I think is this I think he's the same weight as Banjo. Oh really? Yeah. Oh Ooh. good back air. Mm. And now J-Rex starting to get the momentum. I'm I'm questioning this pick a little just because of how consistently good Cortex's Pac-Man was doing. Yeah. Other than that, like, last game and, like, parts of the other games, he was basically had control the whole time. Yeah. 
Yeah. So, uh, may so, maybe he was uncomfortable with J-Rex adaptation and wanted to throw in a curveball to mess with him. Oh, yeah. So maybe if he loses this game, he'll go back to Pac-Man. I, I almost guarantee that if he loses this game, he's going back to Pac-Man. <laughs> like, <gasps> ooh. That was risky. That was smart. <laughs> I mean, I mean if, it you, if you cancel Nikita instantly, it doesn't have, like, almost any lag, so... Oh, okay. If you, like, the, the missile will still come out, but you can act. But he's gonna catch the roll. Yeah, that's that's that was really good. And all of a sudden, Cortex in the lead. Oh, yeah. didn't go for the follow up there. Good. Cortex getting these read rolls hard. He's got a ledge trap situation. That's oh. yeah. That's such a hard situation. He had to roll in order you to, to live there. Uh, you could also just time your get up. Oh, for the invincibility frames. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's hard to time that because you don't know when he's gonna explode it. Of course. It's like impossible to react to. Up throw, up air. Not gonna uh. take it, but good damage. He's, oh, yeah, he's fishing. Oh, good back that air. That was a really good back air. And he baits the... He clearly baited <gasps> that. He's dead to up air. No! He got the air dodge out. Yeah. And so, uh, it looked like there he got the short hop macro. He wanted to bu uh, buffer double jump, which is what you have to do off of that. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Fortunate for J-Rex not to be able to uh, take that stock, and now he's probably going to take a lot more percent because that's what Snake's good at. <laughs> yeah, he needs to look to avoid trading if he can. He wanted the trades at first, but he's definitely not gonna anymore. not want him now. This is a up throw, throw situation. Yeah, I think eventually that connects into itself, but I don't. I mean, he may be past the percent actually. Oh no! This is this hard. is getting to the point where rage up tilt's gonna kill right now. Oh yeah, it'll definitely kill. And he's going yep. for it. Yeah. Great stuff to cortex. Yeah. I mean, wow. We, we questioned the sneak pick, but I did question it, it but. That's because Sherex had strong, such a strong start, but Cortex made the instant adaptation, it seemed, to uh, the specific character-on-character -character matchup to get that victory and was, uh, secure himself a place in loser's quarters. It was also definitely consistency there. Uh, Cortex very consistently ga getting his kills, yeah. which allowed... Um, well, And then on the other side of that, J-Rex very inconsistently getting his kills, and that quickly allowed... Um, it quickly allowed Cortex to get back in that game, even from that lead. As you saw, like, he lost the first stock, but then instantly got up-tilted. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.